Hey guys, Vanbjorn20 back again. If you saw my last Nintendo Switch eShop update video, you saw we got quite a few games coming this week, just like every week. But there's one game in particular that didn't show any gameplay at all. There was like, there's not even a trailer for this game um, from what I know of on YouTube. I've been looking around. There's really no gameplay at all. But I got an email today from the developer of the game and they actually gave me a review copy. So I figured instead of doing like a review of the game like I normally do, I'm gonna do something a little different and actually do like a let's play. We're gonna play like maybe the first 10 minutes or so of the game so we can actually see what you're getting because like I said, there's not really too much gameplay of this game out there. So maybe this will give us some insight whether you actually wanna download this game or not. So let's go ahead and start up this game. This is the first time playing the game. So I have no idea what the game's about. All I know is it's called Mad Carnage. So I don't know, I guess we'll find out together. Okay, so it starts out um, right away with, uh, let me make sure the volume's up. Uh, it starts out right away with, uh, you gotta, you know, just push L and R to get a controller. And it says we got blue, so um, we're blue. This is actually the first game that actually told me a color of a controller, which is kind of odd, because the controller's actually black. But it says we're blue, maybe, I don't know if that's a team, I don't know. I guess we'll find out here shortly. So I can see right away we got campaign mode, custom game, controls, Credits. Let's go to the controls just to see. Okay, it looks like standard. There's navigation. There's a rocket launcher. Next turn. So is this like a turn-based strategy game maybe? Like turn-based? I don't know. Let's just jump into the gameplay and see what it's all about. Let's just jump right into the campaign mode and see what this game's all about. Looks like we have an intro here. Play the intro. Okay, it looks like we got a story. The deep rumble of the eight-cylinder engine shook the dust off the old buildings of the rusted. Yada, 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 yada. I'm probably, if you want to read the story, feel free to pause. I'm not. I'm not going to read it. I'm not a fan of reading a bunch of text. But let's just jump into the gameplay. We want to see gameplay. There's some art here. This is one of the screenshots, I believe, um, that I did see. They didn't really show too much gameplay. So that's what we want to see. We want to dig into the gameplay. So it looks like we got a tutorial here. Um, use the L to select the unit. Okay, use the trigger. All right, so there we go. Um, now we got to select the square. Okay, so let's go ahead and select the square. This is just a tutorial. I have no idea what we're doing. So, okay, so you can move from square to square. So it's kind of like you don't really have full control of the car. It's kind of like you just uh, tell the car where to go. Okay, let's end the turn. Let's go ahead and hit the other square here. So it's almost like a board game almost. From um, It's what it seems like. I don't know. Let's, let's keep digging into this and see what it's all about. Retracing the steps. Okay, so more story, more story. Public library of all places. Unbelievable. All right, so we are going to go ahead and just try to get to the gameplay because that's what we want to see. Alexa, I'm bringing company. All right, so it looks like we got some reinforcements coming or something like that. So now we got some cruisers shooting at us. All right, so this is this has gotten a little bit more interesting. All right, so let's go ahead and move to the next screen square. Like I said, this is just a tutorial, guys. Show you guys what this game is all about. And to me, it almost looks like, I don't really know how I'm supposed to fight these guys. Um, I guess we'll see here in a second. Speed up to avoid getting hit. So let's go to the second square, I guess. End the turn. You gotta remember, you gotta end the turn. It doesn't do it by itself. That's one thing I wish it did. I, I wish it would end the turn itself, especially if you have no more moves to make. Can you go here? Oh no, it won't let you go there, okay. Wow, the car just, wow, the, the cruiser just like killed itself. It's crazy. Move here. So I don't really know what the objective is, honestly, right now. I really don't know what the objective is. This is the tutorial. I guess we'll find out. I'm assuming we just have to get to the end. Oh, maybe right there where that blinking block is. Maybe that's where we got to go. I don't know. We're about to see. So this game is definitely a lot different than I thought it was going to be. Wow, that car just tore that thing up. And is that it? Okay, I, th I guess that's it. Uh, 
bet you damn scavengers didn't see that coming, did you? All right, thanks for the save, Alexa, but I've been wondering something. How did you, how do you keep finding hair dye? What? I don't know if that's supposed to be some humor or what, but looks like we won. Let's go to the next level. So I, I guess the objective is to maybe to take out all the, the cars, I'm assuming. It's not really to get to the end of the level. You have to take out the cars. And we didn't really take out any of the cars there. The other guy did it for us. So let's keep rolling with this tutorial and let's see how this works. Okay, so when you're in range, you can uh, target an enemy. And there we go, that's how you take them out. Okay, so that's that's kind of neat. So let's move into position here. Oh, we have other cars. Okay, we got more cars. Okay, so this, this reminds me of like chess, kind of. This is kind of like, it's almost like you're playing a game of chess, but with cars, if that's fair. I'm pretty sure that's, leave a comment below and let me know, but this feels like I'm playing a game of chess but with cars. Oh, I thought I was in range. I thought I could have been in range. Um, that's, that's what it seems like to me. I guess we'll find out here. And I'm not very good at chess, so as you can see, I already got blown up. Okay, so yeah, we're, we're getting lit up here. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so this isn't ending well for us at all this isn't ending well for us. I'm down to one car to there are three and I'm getting tore up like tore up I don't really know where else I can go so I don't really have any other moves that's gonna take me off the cliff isn't it I, I think I'm screwed here guys I'm like in a corner here I think I think we're legit screwed Yeah, so I, th I think like it's like chess. That's exactly what it is. Like I'm cornered, and there's nowhere to go. So like it's basically so like right now it's basically like checkmate. Like it's over. The only moves I have is to I think every move here is gonna kill me. So yeah, so I'm dead. So it's basically chess. I want to try one more time, just to see if I suck that bad. <laughs> but that's basically it, guys. This is what this game is all about. It's like chess. So let's try. I just want. I want to give it another go. I feel like I deserve another shot here. All right, we got to do better than last time. And I'm assuming the the later you get in the level, I think you can like upgrade weapons and like do do other stuff. I'm sure. I'm sure we're not going to get that far into it, but I do want to show off some gameplay because there's no gameplay of this game at all online. Alright, I want to see... There we go, that's going to put us in target. Boom. Alright, so definitely doing better than last time. I don't want to go too far because that guy is going to end up getting me. So it, it's like you really got to plan out your moves. All right, so let's see how this did us here. Wow, so that guy, it looks like he can take a lot more steps than I could. All right, so we can get this guy here. Goodbye. And I think I can get... Let's go for this guy right here. Oh, it doesn't let you shoot twice. Okay, so you can only take out one at a time. I thought I could take out both of them. Hmm. All right, so he's going to take out this car, obviously. So it's down two to one. All right, so now let's see if I can try to move into position here. Okay, so the wall's in my way, so I can't I can't hit him. So that's there that you can use like the walls and the the rocks and everything else, uh, you know, to get in your way. Huh? 
All right. I think I think we're gonna win this time. Oh no, the rock's still in my way. Oh, he got me. He got me. So it's down one to one. So this is. All right. I think we're gonna get him this time. We're actually in range already. So there we go. I think that's it, right? We won. So there you go, guys. That's pretty much it. I don't want to make this video too long. I just want to show you guys. Um, it looks like there is a garage where maybe you can upgrade things and stuff like that. So matter of fact, let's see. Yeah, it looks like there's a garage. Like I said, you can upgrade your cars, different parts and stuff like that. So if you like strategy games, especially if you like chess, especially this is this reminds me of like you're playing a game of chess, but you're playing it with cars. And uh, it, I don't know, it's kind of kind of interesting. I think this game's like five bucks. Honestly, it's not my kind of game. Like I said, I'm not a big fan of like turn based uh, strategy games, stuff like that. I'm not a big fan of chess either. So um, this is not my kind of game personally. But it looks like if you like strategy games, if you like chess, if you like that sort of thing, this game looks like it's right up your alley. Leave a comment below. Let me know if you like chess, strategy games, turn-based games like that. And uh, let me know if you plan on getting this game. That's pretty much all for right now, guys. And there will be more to come shortly, guys. Thanks again.